farmer cannot do anything without getting appropriate knowledge and without being prepared properly. Like here, this is the agriculture section. We are in this section of planning for value chain development. Any value chain needs proper proper preparation, proper planning, so that we can have uh, that production in the process going well and benefiting the farmer. As you can see like here, we have the objective is food security and uh, wealth creation. Also, to, to get that food food, quality, food security and uh, wealth creation, we must try to work on our uh, factors of production. One is land. And you know as land is becoming small, nowadays we don't only talk about the land, we need space. Whether we are on the Gorofa or where, we can produce there, have chicken there, have even, uh, have what we call uh, those uh, multi-story gardens. We need to work on Chanda and we, we grow vegetables and whatever and we sell. Then we also need rubber. And we don't need that rubber which people used to do. We need now rubber that is appropriate, that conforms with the production process. We also have capital. And when we use capital, because we have seen some people like those who retire, come with a lot of money, can't pick their money, a lot of money and they get frustrated. We need to have sufficient capital, capital that is enough for the process and it can grow with the time. And the, the main factor that can make this factor so productive you know, to, to do well is the management. And this management has got quite a number of factors. The factor of management, the first one is planning. And that planning we have to do which enterprise we want to do. And the second one is when do you do it? That is timing. You might time the market when the demand is high so that you can have good prices. The third one is how, how do you do it? And this is technology. We must have appropriate knowledge that conforms with the production process. And the fourth one is for what do we do? And for why, why do we do it? It's the profitability. Before we tell a farmer to take a, actually a value chain, we need to sit down and tell the farmer to foresee what that farmer can get. And if the farmer sees this one, is there's money that the farmer can now get the water. And from just planning, we can now go to organization. Organization is where the farmer understands the various value chains. And from there, the farmer can plan and they know when the time is there, when the time is not there, must understand when the farmer is required to put the need. It's 